Section. Introduction. In this section, we introduce Jamba, our new large language model. Jamba is unique because it combines transformer layers with Mamba layers and a mixture of experts, Mo, component. This hybrid architecture allows Jamba to have better performance and higher throughput while keeping memory usage manageable. The 7B-based Jamba model we are sharing was designed to work on a single 80 gigabytes GPU, but the architecture of Jamba can be adapted to different hardware and performance needs. The main innovation of Jamba is its hybrid transformer Mamba architecture. While transformers are popular for language models, they struggle with processing long contexts efficiently due to high memory and compute requirements. On the other hand, older RNN models summarize long contexts in a single hidden state but have training and long-distance relationship challenges. Recent state space models like Mamba are more efficient and better at handling long-distance relationships but do not perform as well as transformers of similar size. Jamba combines transformer and Mamba layers in varying ratios to balance memory usage, training efficiency, and long context capabilities. Some recent attempts have also combined attention and SSM modules, but they differ from Jamba in how they mix these components and in their scale of implementation. Jamba is the first production-grade attention SSM hybrid model. We also incorporate Mo layers in Jamba to increase model capacity without increasing compute requirements. By applying Mo at every other layer with 16 experts, we can train extremely large models with strong performance. We evaluated Jamba on various benchmarks and found it to perform similarly to other models with a similar number of parameters. Jamba supports a context length of 256k tokens, the longest among publicly available models. It outperforms other models on long context tasks and is highly efficient, with a throughput three times that of comparable models. We have released Jamba under the Apache 2.0 license to encourage further study and optimization by the community. Our design choices were informed by extensive experiments, and we plan to share model checkpoints from these runs. It's important to note that the released Jamba model is a pre-trained base model and should not be used in production environments without additional adaptation. Section Summary In this section, we introduce Jamba, a large language model that combines transformer and Mamba layers along with a mixture of experts component to enhance performance and throughput while managing memory efficiently. Jamba addresses the limitations of transformers by incorporating Mamba layers, which are more efficient at training and handling long-distance relationships. By leveraging both model families, Jamba achieves a balance between memory usage, training efficiency, and the ability to process long contexts, outperforming other models like Mixtral 8x7b and Llama 270b on various benchmarks. Section. Model Architecture. In this section, we present our Jamba model architecture. Jamba is a unique decoder architecture that combines transformer layers with Mamba layers and a mixture of experts, Mo, module. This combination, known as a Jamba block, offers flexibility in balancing memory usage, throughput, and model quality. When comparing model parameters, it's important to consider the number of active parameters in an Mo model, which may be much smaller than the total parameter count. The KV cache, used to store attention keys and values, becomes a limiting factor when scaling transformer models to long contexts. By trading attention layers for Mamba layers, we reduce the size of the KV cache. Our goal is to have a smaller number of active parameters and an 8x smaller KV cache compared to a standard transformer model. In terms of throughput, attention operations become computationally intensive with long sequences, while Mamba layers are more efficient. Increasing the ratio of Mamba layers improves throughput, especially for long sequences. Our main configuration includes Jamba blocks, each consisting of a mix of Mamba and attention layers, with the option to replace some MLPs with Mo layers to increase model capacity while keeping the active parameter count low. The Jamba architecture offers flexibility in choosing different properties. For example, Increasing the ratio of Mamba layers over attention layers reduces memory requirements for the key value cache, improving processing of long sequences. Balancing parameters like the number of experts per layer and the top experts chosen at each token affects model capacity, memory usage, and compute requirements. 
Our Jamba implementation on a single 80GB GPU includes four Jamba blocks with specific configurations to optimize performance in terms of quality and throughput. The chosen ratios and expert configurations were based on preliminary ablations to ensure computational efficiency and high quality. Our model successfully supports context lengths of up to 1M tokens, with a released version accommodating lengths of up to 256K tokens. Section Summary in this section, we introduce the Jamba architecture, a hybrid model combining Transformer, Mamba, and Mo elements to balance memory usage, throughput, and model quality. By adjusting the ratio of attention to Mamba layers and incorporating Mo modules, Jamba optimizes memory footprint and compute efficiency, enabling processing of long sequences with improved performance. Our specific Jamba implementation on a single 80GB GPU showcases a configuration with 8 layers, a 1 to 7 ratio of attention to Mamba layers, and 16 experts with 2 utilized per token, demonstrating superior context length capabilities compared to other models like Mixtral and Llama. Section, Throughput Analysis. In this section, we will discuss our findings on throughput analysis in two specific scenarios. In the first case, we observed that Jamba can process large batches efficiently, resulting in a 3x increase in throughput compared to Mixtral. Even though Mixtral has a similar number of active parameters, it cannot match Jamba's performance with a batch size of 16. In the second scenario, when using four A100 GPUs without quantization and varying context lengths, Jamba's throughput excels, especially with long contexts where it achieves a 3x higher throughput than Mixtral with 128k tokens. Our model, Jamba, was trained on NVIDIA H100 GPUs using our proprietary framework that supports large-scale training techniques like FSDP, tensor parallelism, sequence parallelism, and expert parallelism. The training data for Jamba consists of text from various sources like the web, books, and code, with the latest update in March 2024. We have a rigorous data processing pipeline in place that includes quality filters and deduplication. When evaluating our model, we approach benchmarks cautiously as they may not fully reflect real-world performance and can sometimes be manipulated to show inflated results. However, we present results from various academic benchmarks to provide an indication of Jamba's performance compared to other models. In long-context evaluations, we have successfully trained Jamba models with context lengths of up to 1M tokens, although the released model can handle up to 256K tokens. Jamba performs exceptionally well in tasks like the needle in a haystack evaluation, where it excels at retrieving specific information from long context windows despite using only four attention layers. Furthermore, in naturalistic long context evaluations involving question answering tasks with long inputs, Jamba outperforms Mixtral on most datasets and demonstrates superior efficiency, especially in handling long contexts with better throughput. Section Summary In this section, we analyze the throughput of our model, Jamba, in two specific scenarios. Firstly, with varying batch sizes and a single A180GB GPU, Jamba achieves a 3x increase in throughput over Mixtral when processing large batches. Secondly, with 4 A100 GPUs and no quantization, Jamba's throughput is 3x higher than Mixtral's at long context lengths of 128k tokens. Despite lacking optimizations for pure transformer models, Jamba's performance surpasses leading models like Llama 270B and Mixtral, showcasing the potential of hybrid architectures and achieving state-of-the-art results with improved throughput. Section. Ablations and Insights. In this section, we conducted ablation experiments to explore different design choices in our implementation of the Jamba architecture. We began by examining the benefits of combining attention and Mamba layers, determining the optimal ratio for their combination and how to interleave them. Our findings revealed that the hybrid Jamba model, which combines attention and Mamba layers, outperformed models using only pure attention or Mamba layers. We discovered that a ratio of 1 to 3 or 1 to 7 for attention to Mamba layers showed similar performance, with the 1 to 7 ratio being more computationally efficient. Therefore, we chose the 1 to 7 ratio for our larger scale experiments. Next, we compared the performance of Vanilla Transformer, 
Vanilla Mamba, and Attention Mamba hybrid models at a 7B model size after training on 50B tokens. The results showed that the hybrid Attention Mamba model outperformed the pure models and achieved better throughput than the vanilla Transformer model. We also investigated why the combination of Attention and Mamba layers worked well. While the pure Mamba model initially showed promising results in most tasks, it struggled in certain benchmark tasks such as IMDB, Quack, and Narrative QA when compared to the pure Attention model. The hybrid Attention Mamba model performed similarly to the Attention model on these datasets, indicating its ability to follow the correct format required for successful in-context learning. Our analysis suggested that the pure Mamba model's difficulty in adhering to the correct format could be attributed to its lack of an attention mechanism, which is crucial for in-context learning. In contrast, the hybrid attention Mamba model successfully followed the format, similar to the pure attention model. We hypothesized that this difference highlighted a potential limitation of SSMs in performing in-context learning. Furthermore, we observed that the hybrid attention Mamba model exhibited successful in-context learning, even with only one out of eight layers being an attention layer. This success in in-context learning was supported by the emergence of induction heads in the model, which are essential for approximate copying operations conducive to in-context learning. In conclusion, our experiments demonstrated the effectiveness of combining attention and Mamba layers in the Jamba architecture shedding light on the importance of in-context learning capabilities for model performance. Section Summary In this section, we conducted ablation experiments on the Jamba architecture to explore the benefits of combining attention and Mamba layers, determining the optimal ratio for their combination and how to interleave them effectively. We found that the hybrid Jamba model outperforms pure attention or Mamba models, with a 1 to 7 ratio being more computationally efficient while maintaining similar performance. The hybrid attention Mamba model exhibited successful in-context learning capabilities, unlike the pure Mamba model, suggesting that the attention mechanism plays a crucial role in enabling effective in-context learning in large-scale models. Section. The Effect of Mixture of Experts, MO. In this section, we explore the impact of mixture of experts, MO, on our hybrid attention Mamba architecture. Recent studies have demonstrated that MO enhances transformer language models while maintaining manageable computational resources. However, it remains uncertain how well MO integrates with state space models on a large scale, particularly with our hybrid architecture. Our experiments indicate that incorporating MO enhances the performance of the hybrid attention Mamba architecture when scaled up to a large size, 7B parameters trained on 50B tokens. The MO variant in our setup consists of a total of 16 experts, with two experts utilized at each token, and MO is applied every two layers. When training Jamba models with up to 1.3B parameters, we observed stable training without significant issues. However, as we scaled up to the largest model in this study, 7B based, with 12B, 52B active, total parameters, we encountered substantial spikes in loss. Further investigation revealed that the intersections of the Mamba layers exhibited high activation values, leading to these spikes. To address this, we introduced RMS norm to regulate the internal activations, as depicted in the figures. This adjustment stabilized the training process and prevented additional loss spikes. Additionally, we examined the Jamba architecture's performance with and without explicit positional information, using rope in the attention layers. The results from our experiments with 1.3B parameter models and 250B tokens suggest that explicit positional information may not be necessary for the hybrid architecture. It is possible that the Mamba layers, positioned before the attention layers, inherently provide implicit positional information. 